All right, day 15, 22nd September, 2022. It's another blessed day, which is great. And as you can see, I'm, my, my face is shining bright today. And you might guess what happened yesterday night. Because the way I'm shining right now, it means something. Oh, you, I'm sure you think I made it, right? Yeah, kinda, but 3 a.m. is not the, it's not what we were aiming for, but we did it. We made it through the 3 a.m. But guess what? It was a failure for us because the goal is to at least reach 6 a.m. every night. But that is just one side of the coin. One side of the point is, as it is stated, need to stay awake throughout the whole night. The other part is, that's another goal. Another goal is for me to be a public guy. And being a public guy means that I have to drop a video every single day. And that one, this is the fifth day, and I'm dropping a video again. So that means that one we are winning. But the other goal, it has beaten our ass up. But it doesn't matter why because look at this hair it took three years for me to have this kind of hair now i can turn it the way i want to turn it you know i can be a lady if i want to be i can you know and this way i look nice and stuff like that and yes but it took how many years three years for this hair to be like this so now, as this other dream is beating me up, I look at this hair and I tell myself, hey, motherfucker, you've only started for about 15 days now. This hair took three years. So, 15 days compared to three years is zero. And this dream it also have its 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 time. The time is going to take for you to be able to do it. It may take more than three years. It may not reach three years, and so on. So if this is what you still say you want, you are able to achieve it through your hair. Then you can also achieve it. All you have to do is just to be patient, and that's it. So that is one thing about me. Instead of me looking at others to get motivated, I like creating things within my own self that serve as a reminder for me that I can do anything I want. And one of it is this hair. Whenever I'm trying to do anything new and it's not working out, instead of me saying, come on, it will never work out. Instead of me saying, I can't do this. If it is what I truly want, I look at this hair and I'm, I'll be like, oh, okay. I'm not even up to three years yet. Maybe when I reach three years and I have not done it, I can now sit down and think about it. Okay, maybe this goal is not for us. But until then, nope, this goal is for us and we are going to go for it and we are going to get it. So that's it. Those are just part of it. And then some of you may be wondering, why do I have a goal like that? Because this one, the hair goal, like I said, it was to serve as a motivation and a reminder to myself that I can achieve anything I want in life. But then, now why do I want to stay awake? And just so before I proceed with this, right now, I've just achieved another thing which is very, very important to me, which add up to some of the reasons why I love to stay awake. Yesterday night, I was able to find out a way to be able to send or to be able to share files from my laptop to my iPhone. It is something I've been trying to do for a very long time. I tried iCloud, I tried, you know, and most of it wasn't what I wanted. I wanted something simpler. And I've been taking this networking course. And yesterday night, guess what? I figured it out. And right now, I have my desktop files on my iPhone right now. So if I want to view things on my laptop, I can do it right now. 
So that is one of the reasons why I want to stay awake throughout the whole night. The reason being that if I want something and I'm willing to sacrifice my sleep for it, then God have to give it to me. Why? Because God is always up there. Now I say I want this. All right. God looked down at me and he'll be like, Ibrahim, come on. It is night time. Go to bed. Everyone is sleeping. You too. Why, why are you not sleeping right now? And I'll be like, God, I just want this. This is what I'm trying to achieve. Please, this is what I want. And I'm sacrificing my sleep for it. So God will be like, oh, it means that you really want this. If not, you will be sacrificing the most precious things to everyone, which is sleeping. And then he'll be like, okay, you've shown that you want it. I'll give it to you. So the point is just about sacrifices. Me staying awake during the night time, it shows me, it tells me that I really want this. Because night time is meant for us to sleep. If I can say that, no, I'm willing to sacrifice that sleeping to get what I want. Because during the daytime, anyone can achieve this. Because the daytime is meant for us to live. Anyone can achieve it. So that's it. I sacrifice my night or I don't sleep to show that I'm sacrificing. Because whatever you want, you have to sacrifice something. You have to. You have to sacrifice something. And so, I decide to sacrifice my sleep during the night. So during the day, I sleep as well. Then get up and try to compete with those who are trying to only do it during the daytime. And that's it. This way, I'm going to be successful more than them. Or at least in a much faster space than them. So that's it. So once again, this is the be yourself guy. Don't forget to be yourself. I'm able to do all of this because I choose to be myself. And being myself is another goal that I achieved. Which took seven fucking good years. I think it may be more or less. I haven't calculated it that much. But let's just say seven good years. For me to be able to be myself. So that's it. But I did it in the end. So what is it that I can achieve again? You can do it as well. If you really want. So that's it. That's the be yourself guy. Don't forget to be yourself. For it is the gateway for us to be whoever. And achieve whatever we want in life. See you tonight. And let's see what happens.